Sir Dave Brailsford, the man behind British cycling's success and the director of Ineos Sport, has been entrusted with reviving Manchester United's fortunes. In a recent documentary series, Brailsford shared his methods and strategies for achieving peak performance. Let's take a closer look at how his theories could be applied at United. Brailsford emphasizes the importance of finding the right balance between a carrot and stick approach to management. He believes in enabling and empowering individuals rather than controlling them. This is something that United managers have struggled with in the past. Eric Ten Hag, the current manager, has leaned more towards an autocratic approach, which has caused some concerns among players. Tackling conflict is another area Brailsford focuses on. He believes in addressing and discussing conflicts openly rather than ignoring them. There have been some divisive issues at United this season, such as the situation with Jadon Sancho, which has yet to be resolved. It is important for the team to address these issues and create a harmonious and united environment. Brailsford also emphasizes the importance of setting rules together as a team. This promotes a sense of ownership and responsibility among the players. United has had issues with indiscipline in the past, and Ten Hag has implemented strict rules to tackle this problem. However, there are still concerns about the intensity of training sessions and the tactics being used. In terms of recruitment, Brailsford stresses the need for thorough due diligence. United has made mistakes in the past by not doing enough research on players before signing them. This has led to issues with discipline and performance. Brailsford believes in looking at an individual's history and how they deal with challenges and setbacks to assess their commitment and drive. Creating a challenge state rather than a threat state is another key aspect of Brailsford's philosophy. United has often looked consumed by fear on the pitch, and this has affected their performance. Brailsford believes in helping athletes control their emotions and see challenges as opportunities rather than threats. Commitment is crucial for success, according to Brailsford. He believes that individuals need to have a deep-rooted desire and hunger to improve. United has had issues with players lacking commitment and motivation in the past, which has led to inconsistent performances. Brailsford also emphasizes the importance of winning behaviors and avoiding losing behaviors. Moaning and negativity are considered losing behaviors, while positivity and resilience are winning behaviors. United has had issues with complacency and negativity in the past, and it is important to address these behaviors. Finally, Brailsford believes in the concept of marginal gains and progression rather than aiming for perfection. He believes in improving multiple aspects of performance by 1% to achieve overall success. United needs to focus on improving various areas, such as nutrition, data analysis, and scouting, to close the gap and return to the top. Sir Dave Brailsford is a fascinating and controversial figure in British sport. He has a proven track record of building successful teams and cultures. As he takes on the challenge of reviving Manchester United, it will be interesting to see how his methods and strategies shape the club's future.